we will derive the resolving power of microscope but before we do that we should know the Rayleigh's resolution criteria criteria it is yeah, it, as you know that when image is formed by optical instrument and when the diffraction takes place because of the wave nature of light you have central maxima which is the image which we actually see in the optical instruments so if there are two objects and let us say that they are forming two different images and this is the image of another object till such time these are separate we can easily see them distinguish them they resolve but when they come closer to what extent they can come closer so that we can resolve them so the criteria there is that the central maxima of one should fall on the first minima of the other for resolution otherwise it will not be resolved so it should not come closer than this this is the minimum closeness which we can permit which we can permit this is the minimum thing this is the first minima of one if we take this as one image of one and this is image of two and this is the central maxima maxima of two so this is the resolution criteria and let us see how we derive the resolving power of microscope let us take a situation where there is a lens of diameter d d is the diameter of lens object is at focal length and let this angle be beta this angle is beta uh, one more thing we need to know before we proceed that in case of diffraction by circular aperture when the, whenever there is a circular aperture and diffraction takes place this is the circular aperture here and when the diffraction takes place the angle theta of the first minima is equal to 1.22 lambda upon d 1.22 lambda upon d using this criteria we will derive the expression for the resolution by microscope what is the minimum distance which it can resolve let this be the aperture with diameter d this is the lens this is object 1 this is at focal length let this distance be l where the image is formed and let this be the central maxima and central minima and first minima of the image by object 1 let there be another object 2 here and for resolution we know that the maxima of the second object should be at the minima first minima of the first object so this distance let this be d2 which is the resolution criteria resolution Rayleigh's resolution let this distance be d2 and the objects distance be let this distance be d1 now we also know that this angle first minima the angle theta which it will make is theta is 
1.22 lambda upon d d is this aperture diameter so theta is also equal to d2 upon l is equal to 1.22 lambda upon d by this we can find out l is equal to d2 d upon 1.22 lambda this is l now let this angle be beta which the object is making with the aperture here and sin beta be equal to tan beta because beta is small tan beta is d upon twice f so f will be equal to f will be equal to d upon twice sin beta is the value of f now what is the magnification magnification is v upon u v is l u is f so we place the value of l and f here l is d2 d upon 1.22 lambda and f is d upon twice sin beta d gets cancelled so we get magnification equal to d2 into twice sin beta upon 1.22 lambda now we know that magnification will also be equal to magnification will also be equal to d2 upon d1 this is d2 and this is d1 separation between the objects and the separation between the image so this we can equate is equal to d2 upon d1 d2 gets cancelled so by this we get d1 is equal to 1.22 lambda upon twice sine beta is the minimum distance minimum distance which can be resolved be resolved by the microscope resolved by this microscope if you want to reduce it further smaller the distance better is the resolution so if you want to improve the resolution we can place fluid here with refractive index mu so the lambda will then decrease lambda dash will be lambda upon mu so d1 will become 1.22 lambda upon twice mu sin beta when we place a liquid there in between the object and the lens so this is the revised uh, resolution when the uh, liquid of refractive index mu is placed so this is all about the resolution by microscope thank you